robotic surgery is not that much different than laparoscopic surgery other than the, the technique uh, causes less pain for the patient. The surgery itself is done robotically. Uh, we actually sit at a consult to do the surgery and the advantages, as I said, are, is less pain. We're doing the same procedure whether we do it laparoscopically, which is more painful. Uh, so we think there's a tremendous advantage for our patients by uh, doing it robotically. There are different techniques for different procedures. Um, we do what is called a single site procedure in which we can do all of the surgery through one site uh, around the belly button. The patient only has one incision. Some procedures we actually have to do multiple ports, but still, since uh, the incision is so much smaller, uh, the patient's uh, pain uh, is much, much less after surgery. So I'm going to introduce you a little bit to the robot today. The patient will be on the table. His head will be here. This is where he'll have his anesthetic. Uh, the torso of the body here. So the abdomen is going to be in this area. And the robot with the trocars will be inside the abdominal cavity. And uh, I will be able to control all of these arms of the robot through the consult over there uh, with just hand movements. I will be looking inside here, and by looking inside, I can see all your internal organs on a four-time magnification, um, and I can do the surgery from this consult. By moving these little arms here, I control all of the instruments which are inside your abdominal cavity. So the visualization and the enhancement of the anatomy is so much greater with the robot than it is with the uh, uh, just the typical laparoscopic procedure. And we think this is a tremendous advantage for uh, patients who want to have the robotic surgery over the conventional surgery.